moving forward today with its effort to step up soccer in the city. The city council is expected to get an important update tonight regarding the planning for a proposed multi-sport complex just off of Grant Line Road. KCRA3's Mike Dussel is live at the site with the actions the council is asking for. Mike. Good morning. We are standing live right along Grant Line Road where it intersects with Waterman. And right there, there's already a sign up proposing the future home of an Elk Grove sports complex. This is something that city leaders envision could be a potential economic boom for the city. Elk Grove Mayor Gary Davis and Elk Grove Youth Soccer CEO Andy Donnery explained to me that this 100 acre spot would be perfect for as many as 16 to 20 grass and turf soccer fields. And the bigger vision here is potentially they would build a professional soccer stadium and hotel here as well. Now, the potential price tag to get this going, according to the city, would be over $100 million. However, Given how popular youth soccer is, some 6,500 kids play it in Elk Grove alone. Donnery said building a soccer complex here could easily generate over $4 million in financial impact just along the weekend soccer tournament circuit that attracts out of town teams to this site. The hope is we have 16 fields, we have a stadium, and we have everything that you would expect a high level, top of the range soccer club to have. The bottom line is we want to bring this land into the city of Elk Grove uh, and move it forward as fast as we can. Now, back here live, it is foggy this morning, so it's, uh, you'd have to use your imagination to envision the soccer fields, the soccer stadium, the hotel that could be on this spot of land just east of Highway 99. But here's the thing this plot of land isn't actually within the city limit boundaries of Elk Grove, so that's why tonight the city council will be making a decision on whether or not to move forward with the process to annex this plot of land and make it part of. The city limits. Live just outside the city limits of Elk Grove, Mike Tassell, KCR Ray 3 News.